hello fellow vintage lovers. Welcome from the bowels of hell, aka Texas right now. Um, we have a heat index today of 115 and it's going to be 108 um, at the time of my joint sale, the three sister sale with Bell and Kel. Um, so I figured I would do this short little video um, to let you guys know that it may not happen. Um, it may be too warm uh, in my house where I do my sales um, if it's going to be 108 at 8 p.m. Um, so it may be delayed. Bell and Kel may come on their channel. Um, so keep your eyes peeled. I'll keep you posted on my community tab. But in the meantime, I decided to cheer myself up down here where it is a little bit cooler and show you guys some friend mail and some items I have purchased from other resellers. So it's been a while since I've done this. Um, and I decided I've got to show you guys some of these amazing things today. So uh, speaking of the three sisters, I want to show you guys some stuff I got from Kelly, Dusty Leather and Lace. Um, the first thing I want to show you is this gorgeous, gorgeous dish. This is Ellie Smith. I hope it's coming through okay. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. I love it. I love it more in person. I got it uh, during one of my sales with Bell and Kel. Pick up this. I think Rocky really likes this Ellie Smith dish as well. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, so then I got this tile, um, this Native American buffalo tile. Um, it does talk about it here on the back. It's from Tucson, Earth Tones. Um, so it is a studio piece, and I love it. I'm going to have to figure out where to put it. Um, it's got Dexter hair on it, it looks like. But isn't that magnificent? I love it. Then I got these. These are so cool. These are wood. And I believe these are probably Indonesian. I haven't looked it up, looked it up yet, but Kelly was selling them, and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have them. I do have a mask collection that I want to show you guys someday. But um, these are teeny tiny, but they do have um, string to hang them, so I haven't decided what I'm going to do with them. I might, 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 might be cool to make them into some jewelry. Oh my gosh, words are hard today. Then I got, oh my gosh, y'all, I got this compact from Kelly as well. Um, this is very old, most definitely antique. I'm not even going to try to open it right now. But look at the mesh here on the bottom. It's just absolutely amazing. Maybe I can get it open. Let's see if I can. Yeah, I can. Look at this. Look at this mesh. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. And I absolutely love it. Thank you, sis. Then I got this compact as well. Um, looks to be Italian. Uh, this one is really old too. I think this one is probably antique um, as well. Let me focus on that. So this is kind of like, oh God. I'm trying to figure out what kind of material this is. It's a hard, like canvasy material, I think. Um, but you can definitely see the age on it. It's so cool. Anything Greco-Roman like that, I'm going to love. Then I picked up this from her, this amazing um, teapot. It's a little cloisonne teapot. I love it. It's beautiful. I'm not quite sure what the flowers are, but um, it's gorgeous. I'm not sure how old it is. I think it's probably antique as well. And I couldn't resist this little art glass snail. He's so freaking cute, y'all. Look at him. Really, really cute. Um, I love the colors in him. I love snails. So, he was a no-brainer. Um, then, Kelly gifted me these owl earrings, which, of course, I love as well. So, so cute. So, there's some friend mail in here. And then, next up, I got this from Misty's Treasure Chest. Um... I'm new to her channel, thanks to the amazing mod, Holy Spirit Firefall, AKA Jane. But I love copper, I love donkeys, so I picked this brooch up. I think he's absolutely precious and I love him. So thank you, Misty. And then another new seller to me is Leslie's Lucky Finds. Um, I found her from Jane Newhouse 
and I picked up three pieces from her. Um, this is a Venturini. I don't have any gold tone necklaces like this, so I thought it was gorgeous and went ahead and picked it up. Then I got this ring. It's not wanting to focus. There we go. Uh, this turquoise inlay. This is Bisbee turquoise. It is sterling. It just doesn't want to focus. It's focusing on. There we go. Isn't that beautiful, guys? Love it. And while we're staying in focus, let me see if I can get this to focus. I can. So this is citrine. And I love it. I love this design. And I love citrine. So I picked that up from her as well. Really nice piece. Very, very pretty. Okay. So moving right along, let me show you the rest of the glass first. I got these from Cricut Harrington. Um, she had a sale a while back, and I got this amazing etched depression glass um, handled dish. It's absolutely gorgeous. I cannot remember if she said who the maker was, but I love the shape. This is going to go with all of my other green glass. Um, look at it. It's just so pretty. Then I got this imperial glass dish. I do collect some imperial. Um, this is a carnival glass piece, as you can tell. I'm not quite sure what the name of the pattern is, but um, it's absolutely stunning. Beautiful. I love the leaves. Then I got this. This is an, a Fenton coin dot um, bowl, rose bowl. Um, I think this is antique, if I remember correctly. But it's absolutely gorgeous. It's carnival, as you can see. There's some of the dots coming through there. It's a really, really cool piece. I love this color. Um, I don't have much glass in this color, so I was really excited to add this one to my collection. Then we're going to move over to my other sister, Belinda. These are pieces I picked up from her. I got this amazing, don't tip over, Snail, uh, brass llama that I love. Look at this, y'all. He's so freaking cute. Focus. Is he not adorable? Oh, I love him. <laughs> he made my my heart happy when I opened him. Then I got these three Lucite Owl pieces. How freaking cool are they? I haven't figured out where I'm gonna put them, but I absolutely love them. Which way are you supposed to go? I think you're supposed to go that way. Yeah, you are. How cool are these, y'all? Ah, oh, love them. Speaking of cool, I picked up this cast iron um, and enamel cricket from Belle as well. Um, it's so cool. It's made in India. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. And then I got this pendant from her. I have a ring and a necklace um, that are in the same style, kind of an aztec -y style. Um, these are Alpaca Mexico, and this is Malachite, I do believe. Ooh, focus for me. There we go. Maybe not Malachite, but it is definitely a natural stone. I love it. I have a black, and I have a red ring. Um, the black is onyx, and the red is coral, so I can mix and match. That's going to be so fun. Then I got this owl brooch from her because I don't have it and it is so freaking cute. Look at this baby. Oh my goodness. I love it. I love the colors. Speaking of owls, I got the sterling silver ring. I haven't worn it yet. I can't wait to wear it. Really cute. I believe Belle said it was vintage. And then these earrings. Um, these are little owl studs. Focus. There we go. Aren't they cute, y'all? Oh, I love them. Then I got um, this cloisonne style uh, pair of earrings here. Really pretty. Not sure if that's a hibiscus. I think so. Y'all let me know if I'm wrong. Then I got um, these lions, which are amazing. They remind me of Laurel Birch. I can't remember if they are. I think they are. Yeah, it looks like they are. How cool. So Bell and Kel have such a variety of items that they're selling now. So if you're looking for hard goods or anything like that, definitely check them out. Um, then I have this poodle brooch that I loved. He's so cute. His enameling is really good. He's got a little pearl collar. 
Love me some Domicene. So I got this from her as well. This pretty fan. There we go. How pretty is that, y'all? Gorgeous. Love the bird. Then I had to get a dragon because, you know, it's a dragon. And I now have my own little dragon, Mushu. Um, but I love Asian dragons. Then I think she gifted me. I'm pretty sure Belle gifted me this. Whoa! This is a little owl pendant. Um, it's on like a, a, a Scrabble um, piece. Look at that. Is that not adorable? Thank you so much. Thank you to everybody who gifted me something. Um, then, oh, I believe that's from Jess. Okay, we'll move over to Jess. Um, Jessica B. Jewelry. I got quite a few things to show that I got from her. Um, one thing is this beautiful basket. Probably antique. Um, it's absolutely gorgeous. Then I got these owl coasters. They're awesome. Oh my gosh, I love them. Are they not phenomenal? Look at this bar now. I've got to pick it up. There we go. Oh, they're so 70s and they're amazing. And I love them. Thank you, Jess. Then I got, she did a lot of earrings and I got this lot. I really wanted these copper um, flower earrings there, but I love them all. And it came with the earring holder, which is always good. Then I got two um, pieces, uh, two necklaces. Cannot talk today. I got this kind of brassy, coppery colored necklace. Um, I believe this is a spur, which is pretty cool. It's got an AB crystal there. Um, and then I got this micro mosaic. And I'm probably gonna research this one a little bit more. First of all, it's beautiful, but I think it's definitely an older piece. Here's the back of it. Is that not gorgeous, y'all? Beautiful. I love that. Thank you so much, Jess. Then she she gifted me and Rick these. Um, this one's for me. I buy antiques. I'm so sorry. There's there's Dexter hair everywhere. Um, I buy antiques for me. And then for Rick, we got musician. How cool is that? He's already said he wants a felt hat to put them on. Thank you, Jess. That was so sweet of you to offer that or to send that to us. Love. Okay, then there are a couple more things I got from Jess. Um, one is this really cool uh, torque bracelet. It has these blue stones. I can't remember. Um, they might be aquamarine. I cannot remember, so just forgive me. As you can see, I've kept a lot of boxes here waiting to do this video, which is really hard to do. Sometimes I just want to rip them open, but I always want to show you guys what I got. Then I got this amazing glass owl from Jess as well. He is so cool. Um, I think I'm going to hang him in my kitchen window. I love him. Then I got her, uh, this Asian doll. Um, I thought she was awesome. I love the shape. Um, it's just so cute, and she's in excellent condition. I love her. Oh, she's so cute. That made me really happy to open that as well, Jess. Um, then I got this one tea from Hemlock Lady. Um, this is a peridot and leather bracelet, and I believe it's handmade. Well, it definitely is handmade. Um, you can see the leather is tool, but you've got this really pretty cluster um, there. How cool is this, y'all? I love it. Absolutely love it. Then from one of my partners in crime, Jane Newhouse. Um, I left her card here. Um, I do sell with her every other Monday, um, and I always put the link on my community page, but um, we have moved that sale to 8 Eastern, just so you know. But um, I got these two unicorns. So I bought this one, which I love. Look at the eye, so freaking cute. And then Maria, California thrifter, bought me this one. Thank you, Maria, I love it, it's so cute. Oh, uh, these are both vintage. And then Jane sent me a cute little card and this amazing cat little pill box, which is awesome. I actually needed one of these, so how perfect is that? And copper and brass colored, uh, that's all me, so me. Um, what else do we have? Oh, yes. So, I got these two 
from Amber, um, Ooh Ah Crochet. Um, this really pretty purple pendant, purple rhinestone and marcasite. And then I got this um, natural stone from her. Now I can't remember the name of it. I'm gonna have to put it uh, when I edit the video. But um, how cool is this? Why do I want to say it's some sort of rose name? Um, but this is how the stone is naturally formed. I've gotten really into crystals and stones again. Um, I think most of you know that. I've started selling some. So that is going in my collection and I freaking love it. So thanks to everybody for all my gifts, for being my friend, for supporting me throughout this journey. Um, you guys mean the world to me. And, um, you know, always buy small when you can, guys. There's so many of us resellers out here, you know, um, trying to make a living doing this. And I always like doing these videos because I love to showcase, you know, the amazing items people have. So, okay, guys, if you don't see me at a sale tonight, you will see me tomorrow. Um, definitely for the treasures and tunes. It's not supposed to be as hot tomorrow. Um, and uh, we can do that one down here where it's a lot cooler. Okay. Love you guys so much. Take care. See you on the flip side.